So we're just going to go over a configuration uh, options within the Zebra Setup Utility and if we have multiple printers and also just how to get a file to a device. And right here we're using a ZQ630 and we want to create a few settings that we can send to the printer. So in, in some cases you may have a download of a complete <coughs> configuration you've gotten from the printer right so in that case that's not something you want to send all to the printer this is more just to kind of for reference you can keep this and see what's in it and then you have settings that are specific to the printer that you want to send down and so that's done by in here right so we can say configure printer connectivity we can say Bluetooth this is an example right enabled friendly name discoverable minimum security mode uh, we're gonna have no pin um, you know reconnect we just kind of leave it at default um, pairing you know just works uh, Bluetooth control classic and low energy minimum security so you go through all these and you say and so here's where you'd have that and you create that file so you copy this from here and now you can create a file like you see here so I'm going to put all these settings here and then I'm going to save it as a text file or I'm going to save it as a ZPL file either or something we can send down to the printer so here's a file so what do we do to get it down so let's see our printer is here and so we could say right here open printer tools right and in printer tools we can go into the settings and send a file so we'll select our file which in this case it's just a ZPL file and we'll send it over and you'll see the printer will probably on the screen say um, restarting so whatever whatever was in that file is now is now configured in the printer so if you have multiple printers you could send it over this way um, if we want to look at it as a printer on our computer so we'll say devices printers and scanners and we're going to scroll down ZQ or Z designer uh, ZQ 630 ZPL so we can come here and we can say manage and then we can go printer properties scroll over to driver settings you'll need to have the zebra print driver on the computer and then go into settings the same thing send a file so you can do it here as well if you don't want to install the zebra setup utility um, another way is if you have the zebra setup utility as you've seen in previous videos we can just select the printer and then copy the command all these commands in the ZSU and then enter enter and then we're going to use send to printer so that'll go and then you'll see your printer restart and then once it restarts it's done um, it's uh, has those configurations so you don't want to you don't want to have send this complete all CV that you got you can go through and pick the things but you got to just make it reformat as UI set var and then give it the name like Bluetooth LE um, you can go through and make the changes so it's formatted like this. So the setting's going to be here, space, and then the next properties. Thank you.